What's good everybody? It's your girl Joanne Gray and I'm back today with another full wig review. Today's wig is Tori in a number 1B. Tori is from the Dina Cali collection. I have no picture of her. It's a division of Midway wig. It is style number M447. Item Tori, T-O-R-I in a 1B. This is again Tori in a 1B. Tori is a stylish boy cut with a very ultra feminine flair. It's a short flippy style. The length around the entire wig is probably one inch in flips all over. But you can take these flips and style them any way that you like. Style this wig to your liking. Make it your own. What I chose to do with my wig is to brush out some of the flips in the front, pull them up off of my face, and as you know, I have alopecia, essentially no hairline, and so I have no hair out in this wig, and it still looks great. I just run my fingernail under the bottom of this wig and cover up the band with this last little layer of hair there, and then comb out some of the flips in the wig, and then... Um, frame my ear with some of those flips that are in the um, uh, right here on the side of my face frame my ear with those that I don't want and then left the rest of the wig just um, kind of stay flippy as it's made here's the back of the wig real clean cut in the back flippy and it flips all the way up to the top of the wig you can sculpt this wig to your liking as it's full of uh, flips everywhere and they can be manipulated and turned. Um, these flips I just turned outward so that I can get it to frame the side of my face so that we can cover up the band of the wig because I have no, none of my own hair is able to, um, I can't pull any hair out to cover the uh, ridge where that band is. So this is all uh, wig. I think it's lovely. I give it two thumbs up. I bought it for little or nothing at the beauty supply store, so it is very possible that Tory is a closeout wig. Then again, maybe it's not. So I'm going to look it up online for you. You do some research yourself and you can come up with a good price for this wig. Or go to your beauty supply store and see if they carry the Dina Cali wigs from the Midway collection. For my jewelry, the earrings I'm wearing, they're either snowflakes or flowers. I want to call them snowflakes since it snowed today. And I think they're lovely. They cost me $0.99. Cent. I bought them from the same place I bought the wig, the local beauty supply store. As well, I went right next door to the Children's Hospital thrift store and bought this cute little blue top. It's a baby doll top. It's very pretty and it matches those earrings. I would say that this entire look is a winner. Again, I don't have a picture, but check out the Dina Cali collection from Midway. This wig is called Tori, T O R I. I'm not sure if it's a closeout wig, but it didn't cost much. So, this ends my review, and I'll be back later for another wig review for you. This wig is a winner two thumbs up. It is appropriate for work, it's appropriate for church, and it's an appropriate wig for every day. So I highly recommend it. God bless.